First, smallpox pandemic happened. Then, Spanish flu happened in 20th century followed by SARS and H1N1 pandemic. Currently, we are facing COVID-19 pandemic. There are three ways to build a pandemic resilient community through medical science. First, diagnosis tests. Second, by using drugs. And lastly, the most effective way is by injecting vaccine. First, early and accurate diagnosis tests of pandemics should be carried out as undiagnosed patients can unknowingly transmit the disease. Thus, diagnosis can help to prevent or stop an outbreak. RT-PCR is used to detect the presence of COVID-19 virus by reverse transcription to transcribe RNA of the virus back to DNA. Then, PCR amplifies DNA into hundreds and thousands of it to be enough for analysis. Next, antiviral drugs are used to treat infections of pandemics. Tamiflu is used to control H1N1 virus by blocking an enzyme called neuraminidase, which helps the virus to replicate and reducing symptoms of flu. To control COVID-19 virus, chloroquine and hydroxychloroquine can be used in Malaysia. They are polymerase inhibitors that keep the virus out of host cells by blocking host receptors. This can prevent the production of viral proteins. Lastly, the most effective way is by injecting vaccines. Vaccines contain dead or weakened pathogens. Antigens on pathogens stimulate the immune system to produce T lymphocytes to attack host cells infected by the pathogens. B lymphocytes are also stimulated to form memory cells that can recognize the same pathogen. Through vaccination, permanent immunity to the disease can be achieved. The first ever vaccine is invented by using cowpox virus to make smallpox vaccines. People infected by cowpox virus will gain immunity against to smallpox infections. For a Spanish flu, flu vaccines have been manufactured by using fertilized chicken eggs. Each of three predicted candidate vaccine viruses grow in separate egg and combine to form a vaccine. In conclusion, methods to build a pandemic resilient communities in medical field include diagnosis tests, drugs and injecting vaccines. Although vaccine is the best way to treat the pandemics, there are still many vaccines are in development such as the COVID-19 vaccines. Thus, let's hope for more vaccines to be manufactured so that our community can fully recover from these pandemics.